Today's horoscope from Astro Academy, Cancer, November 5, 2021. It's not yet the time to take action or begin anew, because a new moon is just ahead. Still, this is a fine day to put something behind you a matter that's been weighing you down or standing in the way of personal growth. You might naturally pull yourself back from the world just a little so that you can collect yourself and make space for positive new energy to enter your life. The sun has been transiting your spirit sector, gently encouraging you to learn new things, but it's the new moon tomorrow that seals the deal and helps you move forward. Today favors contemplation and observation, and you might choose to lay low in some way or pull yourself out of regular activities to connect with your deeper needs and desires. While you are inclined to be a little introspective, the day is nevertheless good for communication. Generally, though, it's a good time to slow down and pace yourself, and you'll find that things fall into place as you do. Since there are not any major transits or aspects, the moon truly shines in Libra. The beautiful, reciprocal lunation is asking you to reflect on your professional investments and collaborations. Your mind is clear and balanced with logic. So, as you reflect on your professional investments, now is the time to see each one for what it is. Ask yourself what collaborations serve your professional development. Consider whether your investments will pay off in your intended manner. Embrace the lunar energy to organize and prioritize your collaborations to be successful in your profession. Just before leaving your financial sector today, the moon will align with Mercury, something it has done twice before over the last two months. However, this alignment today is not only their last, but the last before all planetary activity on this side of the financial fence ends in two days. Before it does, this is bringing your financial instincts and a smart head for money together. You have great character and want to make the most of a bad experience, once you are far enough away from it. Nothing will help you get through hard times more than regular exercise that involves deep breathing. It sorts out the body and mind by generating the flow of freshly oxygenated blood and improving your circulation. Yoga is probably something you do already. Try to find the best time of day to practice for you and make it a healthy habit. Having the moon not only return to an adventurous part of your chart but align with Mars here for the first time in nearly two years during Venus' last full day in your career sector is not the case of bad timing that it sounds. Instead, as Venus is consciously working to leave you with expectations and resolutions that are more about the what than the when, where, and how, this can guard against overthinking things. There is a passion for adventure brewing that can't be denied. In the lead up to Venus, the planet of love's return to a social and serendipitous part of your chart tomorrow there is a sense of anticipation in the air, but also a need to start trusting your heart and your instincts. For when Venus returns tomorrow and starts using the laws of attraction and synchronicity to create serendipitous moments and or encounters, this is how she will send the right clues at the right time. You're ready to take charge of your current situation, and we love to see it. As you may know, the moon influences everything from your romantic desires to your general sense of fulfillment, and it continues to glimmer through your intimate eighth house of sex, mergers, intimate unions, and soulmate connections. How are you and your lover showing up for each other and this connection? Luna's close proximity to Mars and Mercury brings energy, vitality, and passion to this area of your life, but there's more. The Moon will simultaneously trine your traditional planetary ruler, Jupiter, inspiring you with faith and spiritual wisdom. 